Welcome to Anime Lore Unveiled, the place where we delve into the hidden corners of your favorite anime universes. In today's episode, we are taking a deep dive into a world of darkness and mystery, the Goblin Slayer universe. Known for its gritty realism and heart-pounding action, Goblin Slayer has captivated millions of fans worldwide. But beyond the epic battles and thrilling quests, there is an untold story, one that lurks in the shadows of the Goblin Slayer universe. It's the story of the goblins, the notorious creatures that strike fear into the hearts of even the bravest warriors. Have you ever stopped to wonder, how did these creatures come to be? What is their true nature, and why are they so integral to the narrative of Goblin Slayer? Buckle up, anime fans, because we are about to embark on an exciting journey into the untold origin of goblins in the Goblin Slayer universe. So, grab your popcorn and settle in, because we're about to unravel the enigma of goblins. Have you ever pondered the origins of the cunning and relentless goblins in the Goblin Slayer universe? Welcome to a world where goblins are the embodiment of fear and terror, a universe where their notorious reputation precedes them. These creatures, often dismissed as the lowliest of monsters, are far more than meets the eye. They are cunning, ruthless, and relentless striking fear into the hearts of even the bravest warriors. Goblins are creatures shrouded in mystery, their origins veiled in obscurity. Their survival instinct and adaptability are unparalleled, making them a formidable enemy. Their reputation has only been enhanced by their notorious acts, which are enough to send shivers down anyone's spine. But there's more to these creatures than their terrifying facade. They are a crucial part of the Goblin Slayer universe, adding layers of complexity and depth to the narrative. So buckle up and prepare for a journey into the unknown. Join us as we delve deep into the untold history and evolution of these fascinating creatures. In the world of Goblin Slayer, the origins of goblins are shrouded in mystery. Yet they are an integral part of this universe, their existence as ancient as the tales that tell of their deeds. Some believe that goblins are the twisted offspring of the gods, birthed from the dark corners of their divine minds, while others theorize they are the result of ancient curses, forever doomed to live as creatures of spite and malice. In the Goblin Slayer universe, the creation of goblins is often linked to ancient folklore. In many cultures, goblins are seen as tricksters, entities born out of chaos and disorder, their sole purpose to disrupt the natural order of things. In these tales, goblins are creatures of the night, preferring the cover of darkness to carry out their mischievous deeds. Whether these myths hold any truth in the world of Goblin Slayer is a question left unanswered. Another theory suggests that goblins are a natural byproduct of the world's evolution, much like any other species. They are the result of the harsh and unforgiving environment, survivors in a world where only the fittest thrive. Goblins in this sense are seen as a testament to the world's cruel reality, a reflection of its inherent brutality. Interestingly, some even propose that goblins are not born, but made. This theory suggests that goblins are the result of dark magic, created by sorcerers or witches for their sinister purposes. They serve as underlings carrying out the nefarious deeds of their masters. This conjecture, while intriguing, is as unproven as the rest. The myriad theories surrounding the birth of goblins add to their enigmatic nature, making them even more fascinating and terrifying at the same time. What is undeniable, however, is the role they play in the world of Goblin Slayer. They are an embodiment of fear, a manifestation of the darkness that lurks within the hearts of all beings. Despite their unknown origins, one thing is certain. Goblins have been a scourge since time immemorial. Their existence is a dark reminder of the world's inherent chaos, a testament to the relentless struggle for survival that defines the Goblin Slayer universe. Goblins, despite their primitive nature, have a complex and hierarchical society. Now this might seem counterintuitive given their beastly appearances and often brutal behavior, but allow me to peel back the layers of the Goblin society for you. At the heart of their society lies the Goblin King, the strongest and often the most cunning among them. The Goblin King not only rules with an iron fist but also serves as a symbol of power and unity. Directly under the King are the Goblin Champions, 
the elite warriors who are entrusted with the task of leading the raids and defending their lairs. Goblin society is largely stratified, with each goblin knowing its place in the hierarchy. From the lowly goblin pups, who are more or less cannon fodder, to the goblin shamans who wield dark magic and provide spiritual guidance, each role is crucial to their survival and propagation. Now let's talk about their way of life. Goblins are scavengers and raiders by nature. They survive by pillaging nearby villages, looting everything of value and capturing prisoners for their own nefarious purposes. This plundering lifestyle not only sustains them but also fuels their endless expansion. Despite their insular existence, goblins do interact with other races, though not always peacefully. They are known to forge uneasy alliances with other monstrous creatures when it suits their interests. But their relationships with these creatures are usually as volatile as their nature, often resulting in betrayal and conflict. The Goblin Society also has its own set of rules and customs, albeit primitive and cruel by human standards. They respect strength above all, and the weak are often discarded or used as bait. Their brutal customs and relentless aggression reflect the harsh realities of their world, a world where survival is a constant battle. So what does all this tell us? It tells us that goblins are not just mindless monsters. They are organized, strategic, and relentless in their pursuits. Their society, as brutal and unforgiving as it may be, is a testament to their will to survive and thrive in the harsh world of Goblin Slayer. Goblins represent the darkest impulses of humanity. This statement may sound harsh, but it holds a kernel of truth when you delve into the world of Goblin Slayer. The moral complexities surrounding the Goblin Slayer's mission to eradicate goblins are as thought-provoking as they are unsettling. Goblins in this universe are not merely mindless monsters. They are cunning, relentless, and driven by a primal instinct to survive, much like humans in dire circumstances. This comparison is not intended to justify their heinous acts, but rather to provide a mirror reflecting the monstrous potential dwelling within us, the humans, when pushed to extremes. The Goblin Slayer's mission is not just about vanquishing a threat. It's a personal vendetta, born from a traumatic past that left him with nothing but a burning desire for revenge. His relentless pursuit of goblins is a manifestation of his own struggle to cope with his past, to reclaim control over his life and to prevent others from suffering the same fate. Yet this quest for revenge raises questions about the cycle of violence. Does the annihilation of goblins truly lead to peace, or does it merely perpetuate a cycle of hatred and fear? Is there redemption to be found in this seemingly endless struggle? The series doesn't shy away from exploring these heavy themes. It forces us to confront the harsh realities of trauma and the lengths one might go to seek retribution. It makes us question our own perceptions of justice and morality. Revenge might provide a sense of satisfaction, a feeling of justice being served, but at what cost? And more importantly, does it truly heal the wounds of the past? Goblins, despite their monstrous depiction, serve a critical role in this narrative. They are the catalysts for these difficult questions, the embodiment of the adversities that test the characters' resolve and shape their identities. Goblins, in their own twisted way, reflect the unforgiving and brutal nature of the world. Their existence is a grim reminder of the world's harsh realities and the lengths one must go to survive. They are more than mere adversaries. They are symbols of humanity's struggle against its own dark nature. Goblins are more than mere adversaries in the world of Goblin Slayer. Their existence, their relentless aggression, and their cunning nature all play a crucial role in shaping the narrative and the world within it. In the grand scheme of the Goblin Slayer universe, goblins represent a constant and ever-present threat. They embody the struggle for survival in a world that is often hostile and unforgiving. Each goblin raid, each close encounter with these creatures, is a stark reminder of the brutal reality of life in this world. The struggle against goblins is not just a physical battle, it's a battle of wits, a test of endurance, and a trial of one's resolve. Moreover, goblins are not just symbols of danger and destruction. They also serve as a mirror, 
reflecting back the darkest aspects of humanity. Their relentless aggression, their disregard for life, their cunning and cruel tactics, all echo the worst impulses and behaviors that humans are capable of. They are, in a sense, a personification of humanity's own potential for monstrous behavior. Goblins also underscore the themes of trauma, revenge, and redemption that run throughout the series. The Goblin Slayer's own traumatic past fuels his unyielding mission to eradicate these creatures. His quest is not just about slaying goblins, it's about confronting his own demons, seeking vengeance for the wrongs done to him, and finding a path towards healing and redemption. Furthermore, the presence of goblins challenges the characters to question their own values and morals. Is it right to kill these creatures who are merely trying to survive in their own way? Is it justifiable to use any means necessary to eradicate them? These are complex questions that add layers of depth to the Goblin Slayer narrative. In conclusion, goblins are a vital part of the Goblin Slayer universe. They are not just monsters to be slain, but symbols of a broader struggle for survival, reminders of humanity's darker side, and catalysts for complex moral dilemmas. Goblins, in all their terrifying glory, serve as a stark reminder of the harsh realities of the Goblin Slayer universe. Goblins, for all their cruelty and savagery, hold an undeniable place in the world of Goblin Slayer. Over the course of this exploration, we've peeled back the layers of Goblin lore, tracing their origins from ancient folklore to their nuanced portrayal in the Goblin Slayer series. We've dissected their societal structure, their relentless aggression, and the reasons behind their cunning nature. These creatures, often dismissed as mere antagonists, embody much more. They represent the darker side of humanity, the relentless struggle for survival, and the harsh realities of a world fraught with danger. In Goblin Slayer, they're not just adversaries. They're a mirror reflecting the darkest impulses of humanity. Their existence, their actions, and their impact on our protagonist's journey bring forth a narrative rich with complexity. They force us to grapple with moral dilemmas, to question the lines between good and evil, survival, and savagery. So the next time you see a goblin in Goblin Slayer, remember, they are more than just monsters. They are a reflection of the world's darkest corners, a symbol of survival in a brutal world. Anime enthusiasts, lore explorers, and Goblin Slayer fans, we've reached the end of our Goblin lore expedition. If you've enjoyed this deep, intricate journey into the world of Goblin Slayer and found the exploration of Goblin lore fascinating, then we have a lot more in store for you. Anime Lore Unveiled is your go-to place for in-depth analysis, theories, and explorations into your favorite anime series. Here we delve deep, uncover secrets, and bring you closer to the heart of your beloved narrative. So, if you want to continue this journey of discovery and discussion, don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button and join our community. By subscribing, you'll be the first to know when we release new videos, and you'll always be up to date with the most recent theories and lore explanations. Remember, in the world of anime, nothing is as it seems. And at Anime Lore Unveiled, we're dedicated to unveiling those hidden truths. So, stay curious, keep exploring, and let's continue our journey into the unseen world of anime together. Subscribe now and join the Anime Lore Unveiled community today.